Yo, I got banned from events, and here's how it went down. I did nothing wrong, man. I did nothing wrong whatsoever. I got banned. I didn't even know I got banned. I didn't get no email. I didn't get no explanation. I didn't have a chance to explain myself. I just got banned. I got a message from Doug Zeep that I got banned from Konami. Konami doesn't even message me and tell me I'm banned. So I got banned from my old video I made where I jokingly made a video. I jokingly, jokingly told the world that I stalled for time. I didn't stall for time. And you know, with a brain would realize it was a joke. It was a joke that was good. It was a good joke at the time. It was the, the new time rolls were going on. Oh, ha ha, cowboy for game. It was a new joke that cowboy for game. It's a joke. It's like firewall pass. It's just a joke. So I make a joke saying cowboy for game, which I did cowboy for game someone, but that doesn't mean I'm cheating. I'm following your time rules, Konami. And then I get banned. Banned. Not even without an explanation for a year. Not three months, a year. I get banned for absolutely nothing. If I get banned for, you know, like, actually cheating, if I get banned for sleeping with someone's girl while playing, okay, give me a ban. But I didn't even do anything. I just got banned for nothing. Konami, I demand an explanation. I demand to be unbanned, all right? That's absolutely pathetic of you. Not even an explanation? What? I'm absolutely fuming right now, man. Regardless of this ban or not, Triff Gaming will still go on and it'll be on forever. Triff Gaming will never die. But I want to be unbanned so I can win events. This is my year to win events. Konami, you stopped me from that. Unban me now. This is my year to win multiple events. To grow my YouTube even more. If you don't unban me, I can't do that and I did nothing wrong. It's like banning a rabbit. A rabbit did nothing wrong. Why don't you go ban that rabbit? Why don't you go ban a cat? They did nothing wrong. I did nothing wrong either. Unban me, Konami. Regardless, the channel will go big and strong regardless of Konami. Even though I'm fuming right now, it will still go big and strong. I'll still go to events and get profiles of events. I just can't play. I'm furious, man. I'm absolutely furious. I'll give you guys an update when I figure I sent an appeal in. I sent a whole email in. A big angry email of telling me the pen god telling them unban me. Or at least give me an explanation of why I'm banned. Did I do something I don't know? Like I know it can't be for the Gaga Cowboy thing because I was if you had a brain you realize it was a joke. Alright, so we're on my email now. I'm going to show you guys the message. Man, I'm furious about this, man. I'm absolutely furious. I know this. Like, I was furious. I sent them a message. It has to work, man. This email, I spoke from the heart. I spoke from the heart. So I sent them a message. Are you kidding me? Exclamation mark. Okay. Has to be all caps so they understand I'm mad. Konami. As a loyal customer for the last 10 years, I demand an explanation. My name is Steven J. Trifonoski. I have a YouTube that promotes the well-being of your game and I'm an avid player of the game. I'm being humble. I'm the greatest player of all time in your game. Anyways, I did nothing wrong and get banned for a year. And we get an email and explanation. WTF? Are you kidding me? I did not do anything wrong and I get banned. And not even explanation. Question mark, explanation points. I mistakenly make a joke on a YouTube video boosting about how I used to use time to my advantage with Gaga Cowboy. But anyone with a brain would realize it was clearly a joke and theatrical. And it's out of proportion with absolutely zero truth. And I get banned for a year with an explanation. Are you kidding me? Like, are you kidding I never cheated in this game and I never will. To make matters worse, I figured out I was banned from a friend texting me. A, te a friend texted me and told me this. I didn't even get a message from Konami. Like, Konami didn't even send me a message and told me this, bro. Like, bro, like, I didn't even get a message from these guys. I didn't even get a, like, hey, why are you, I didn't even get a message. Anyways, onto the, the angry email. Uh, I never cheated in this game and I never will. To make matters worse, I figured out, yeah, I already said that. And that's pathetic. It's pathetic that I wasn't even told from Konami. I did not. I did nothing wrong. I should not be banned. I demand an explanation. I demand to be unbanned. I did nothing wrong. I'm absolutely furious. I'm getting treated like this when I make daily videos promoting this very game. I refuse to be banned for no reason. I demand an explanation and to be unbanned as soon as possible. It's completely crazy. I did nothing wrong. From Stephen J. Trevanoski, future greatest Yu-Gi-Oh! YouTuber of all time and furious customer that will drown the internet with bad reviews on Konami, but I don't get a response within the day. Uh, you have five hours left before I flood the internet with bad reviews. 
is absolutely horrible. I still can't believe that they did this to me. So I sent an angry message. Whatever. Don't care. All right. Konami, unban me. This is absolutely pathetic. I did nothing wrong. I'm still banned. It's absolutely infuriating to me. But regardless, the channel will stay strong. Triff Gaming does not die. We will not die. We will only further from there. We will get better and better and better from this. But regardless, it makes my life a little harder. So unban me. But Triff Gaming will never die. Bigger than Konami. Bigger than Konami is what we're going to be. Konami. <sighs> You unleash the beast. See you guys in the next video. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving. I'm not fucking leaving!